Sometimes your teacher will ask you to export a final version of what you've got in NoteFlight into OneNote. Um, and it's a slightly complicated um, thing to do, but once you've done it a couple of times, it'll be like second nature. Um, so first of all, you need to open NoteFlight and you need to have your um, uh, your composition up. I've got a foghorn fanfare here. Um, and then on the three lines menu here at the top left, um, you go to score. And we're going to export two separate things here. The first is going to be um, uh, the actual score itself. And the second is going to be an MP3. So you click export. It's full score PDF um, that you want. Click continue and then click save and it'll go to your downloads folder where we'll find it um, in a moment. You can see that that's uh, opened up now. Okay. Uh, you're also going to export uh, an MP3 copy. That's continue. And it, if it's a very long um, score, it'll take a while. Um, and again, you press um, close and you can see it's down here. Then you have to open your OneNote folder um, and go to the relevant composition folder and click add page. And once you've done that, um, type uh, the name of the composition. Um, if it helps you, you can put in the date, but actually you'll see it does put the date in for you as well in OneNote. Then select the main body of the text and you're going to go to the insert menu at the top and click File. Um, it probably ended up in your Downloads folder. Um, so first of all, we'll put in the um, MP3. So you double click on that. Um, and choose the option to insert as attachment. There we go. Uh, and then you go back to File again, Insert File, and it's PDF. And click Open again. And then you click insert as printout and then it puts in the PDF as pictures and that's it. That's all you need to do. You can also um, click the play button here to listen to your piece um, and it means that I can write any comments that I need to um, here on the, uh, uh, on the sheet of paper. Um, thank you very much for watching.